Hey everybody, Lucas Hanneman here. Welcome to this week's episode of Guitar Tone Tuesday. As you can hear based on that intro clip, we've got a couple of things to talk about today. Not one, but two new pedal designs by my friend Trevor May from Mayfly Electronics right here in Ottawa, Ontario, Canada. That's right, on Guitar Tone Tuesday, as you guys know, we like to support local. And rightly so, because there are so many businesses out there that you guys just don't hear about in the mainstream. Businesses that literally are as good, if not better, than all the other stuff out there, who deserve more recognition. So, that's what Guitar Tone Tuesday is about. And if you like that, and if you're new to the show, like, share, and subscribe, because we're going to talk about many more things like this. All right, we got two pedals today, so we got to get to it. What's up first on the menu? This. We're going to eat some duck. <laughs> this is the Mayfly Canard. And for those of you who can't see this that well, it is a duck with a microphone. <laughs> That's pretty amazing. A duck singing into a microphone. I think that really says it all. Do I have to explain? Well, this is an envelope filter. Envelope filters are basically Ottawa effects. Um, and it's fitting because Trevor is from Ottawa. All right, all right, all right. Okay, jokes aside. Ottawa has been around for a long, long time. You guys think about the Qtron pedal and, uh, you know, that stuff that Bootsy Collins did in the 1970s. You've heard... You've certainly heard auto wah, whether you knew it or not, because it often sounds just like a regular wah wah pedal, but it takes away all the effort of having to rock your foot back and forth. Instead, you get to do it all with your hand and how hard you strum the strings or pluck the strings. Now, Trevor has made your life even easier with this pedal because he made it extra sensitive to how hard you're hitting your strings. We have controls for attack, decay, and range. The insides of this pedal are much like the insides of a compressor. That's why it's hence the attack and the decay. So the attack basically controls how hard you have to hit to get the threshold of the wah to open. The decay is how long the pedal goes wah or wah, right? And the range, the range controls your tone. And that's as best as I can explain it, not being a pedal designer. But the most important thing is we need to listen to it. So I'm going to pick up a Telecaster. And we're going to hear what the heck I'm talking about. Here we go. Man, I gotta say, these pedals are putting me in a goofy, goofy mood. <laughs> 
I love, love, love the envelope filter. But what do we have for our main course? We're going to get fuzzy. This is the Demon Girl fuzz. Again, the artwork on this pedal. Tremendous. Trevor, you're a genius. This is fantastic. <laughs> so this pedal is really interesting. This is, I asked Trevor, I said, like, what would you compare it to in terms of fuzz pedals? And he said, well, it's kind of like a tone bender, but it's got its own thing going on. And I, I, I agree with that. This pedal is super interesting. I mean, the controls are very uh, interesting. I mean, it's, it's pretty straight ahead, except it has this one control down here called Crush. And I don't know what that means, but I like it. Um, and, you know, on top, we basically have like, it's basically like a level control and a fuzz control. But we also have this little tiny little toggle switch here. And this switch does some amazing stuff. In the lower position, what it does is it makes your tone tighter, less bassy, uh, which is really cool for cutting through a mix. Because sometimes fuzz, fuzzes can get very like, you know, kind of big sounding and woofy. But if you lean this thing out in that switch uh, in the lower position, it sounds super cool. So I'm going to actually pick up a 335 style guitar, my Eastman T185MX. And uh, I'm going to start off with the control in this lower position. And then I'm going to bring it up and we're going to hear full fuzz glory. And I'm going to mess around with the controls a bit. So let's hear the Demon Girl fuzz. <laughs> Now I'm going to pick up a Strat, and we're going to go for something more subtle with these two pedals. Pay particular attention to how well my guitar cleans up when I roll back my volume control, especially with the fuzz pedal. Thank you. 
So there you have it. Two amazing new pedals by Trevor May from Mayfly Electronics. The Canard. <laughs> Envelope filter. And the Demon Girl Fuzz. I love these things. I think Trevor has really hit it out of the park with these two designs. He just keeps getting better and better and better at what he does. And I gotta say, if you like the sounds of these pedals, don't forget to check out Trevor's website, which I'm going to link in the description box below. And I will also link to a couple of stores, Spaceman Music and Lozon's Music here in town, where you can pick up his stuff. Stores that will ship all over the world. Thank you so much for watching. Again, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and we will see everybody again very soon. Take care.